Hallelujah. Welcome today. Welcome everyone to the word for today with myself, Jason. And today I have an awesome word for you. And the word for today is think like Jesus. Amen. And I'm going to read from Philippians chapter 2 with the King James Version, uh, verse number 5. Let's see what it says as I go there. Amen. Philippians 2 verse number 5 says, Let this mind be in you which was also in Christ Jesus. Hallelujah. So today as you go about everything that you're going to do, you have to have this same mind, same attitude, which was in Christ Jesus. So what was that mind and what was that attitude which was in Christ Jesus? So when we study the life of Jesus, we can see how he went about doing things. You know, the Bible tells us that how God anointed Jesus of Nazareth with the Holy Ghost and with power who went about doing good, healing all those who were oppressed of the devil. So have the same mindset that as you go out today, that you are someone who is bringing life and freedom to everyone and every situation. Let's just continue reading that Philippians 2. I'll take it from verse number 6. Because remember we said we are considering the same mindset which Jesus had. And what does it say here? So Philippians 2 verse number 6, it says, Who being in the form of God thought it not robbery to be equal with God, but made himself of no reputation, and took upon him the form of a servant, and was made in the likeness of men. And being found in the fashion as a man, he humbled himself and became obedient unto death, even the death of the cross. So from this, for the word for today, we can see that the mindset that Jesus had was a mindset of humility. He was always lowering himself down because he was God himself. But he left the throne and he humbled himself and became obedient to the will of God, even up to death. So today, as you go out today, all you have to remember to do, just have that same mindset to think like Jesus. Amen. And how do you think like Jesus? Humble yourself. Hallelujah. And be obedient to what the Lord tells you to do. Have a blessed day and I'll be back again tomorrow with another awesome word. You can just take this declaration as I close. Just make this declaration and say, I declare that I think like Jesus. I have the mind of Christ. Everything I do, I do to please my heavenly Father. In Jesus' name, amen. Hallelujah. An extra verse just in closing. Let's read 1 Corinthians chapter number 2. After we've taken this declaration, 1 Corinthians chapter number 2. And I'll read Verse number 16. Amen. Let's see what does it say. It says, For who has known the mind of the Lord, that he may instruct him, but we have the mind of Christ. Hallelujah. So this is how you will be able to think like Jesus. You have got the mind of Christ. Hallelujah. I'll be back again tomorrow with another awesome word. Remember to share this podcast, share this word with someone. And God loves you. I love you so much. Be blessed. Amen. Thank you for listening. Thank you for watching. Remember to like, follow, subscribe and share this word and share this message. If you're not sure about your salvation, you're not sure if you're saved, say the prayer to follow. The greatest miracle is salvation. Lift up your hands to heaven. Everyone just lift up your hands to heaven. Hallelujah. And just say this prayer with me. Say, Lord Jesus. Today, today, I've heard your word. I've heard your word. And I believe. And I believe that you are the Son of God. That you are the Son of God. I believe. I believe that you love me. That you love me. That you died for me. That you died for me. That you rose from the dead for me. That you rose from the dead. And I take you, Jesus. Take you, Jesus. As my Lord. As my Lord. As my God. As my God. As my King. As my Savior. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Oh.